tonight on the new dating game. You'll meet Francesca is from Naughty, New Jersey, and she loves humans and human rights. She goes crazy for impassioned pleas um, around human rights campaigns. She loves walks on the campaign trail, politics, pros, and getting down and dirty to win a campaign. Can you please give a big hand for Francesca? Hi, everyone. <laughs> All right, bachelors, why don't you say hello to the lovely Francesca, bachelor number one. Hi, Francesca. This is Biff. Um, I'm a popular athlete and in a popular fraternity on campus. And uh, I just want to say I like humans, too. Bachelor number two. Yo, Francesca, what's up? Uh, my name's Patchouli. I am studying environmental studies and also liberal studies as well. And uh, I really dig that you're into the human rights because that's really righteous. All right, and bachelor number three. Hi, Francesca. My name is Leonard, and I'm a computer programmer, uh, engineer, double major. And, and I look forward to going on a date. Thank you, bachelors. All right, Francesca, take it away. Hey, bachelors. So, here's my first question. What is your most imaginative idea to win a human rights campaign on campus? Bachelor number one. Human rights campaign? Uh, I like humans. Okay. Bachelor number two. You know, probably, uh, probably the, the most righteous thing that you could do is to have a drum circle in the president's office right around the secretary's desk because then you feel like you're really harnessing that good energy and the secretary is part of that drum circle so you're not alienating them but you're showing your discontent with the human rights situation on campus. Thank you, bachelor number two. And finally, bachelor, bachelor number three. When you're playing Doom and you kill somebody, you get an action alert that tells you how many people have died in Darfur to date. All right, thank you, bachelors. Okay, great. Question number two. What qualities do you look for in a perfect campaign partner? Bachelor number one. Uh, yeah, I like uh, someone that can party hard and uh, campaign hard. Yeah. Great. Bachelor number two. Um, you know, uh, I like someone that when we're talking about the difference between crocheting and knitting, knows the full history of activism back in the 60s with Abby Hoffman and all those other folks that were just out there doing it, you know? Great. Bachelor number three. Oh, definitely somebody who knows the difference between HTML and PHP when sending out action alerts. All right. Thank you, bachelors. Okay, question number three. What would you do with a $500 grant for your campaign date and event? Bachelor number one. Uh, yeah, party, yeah. Okay, bachelor number two. You know, I think it'd be really, really cool if we could, um, <clears throat> you know, bring in a jam band and they could just like pick all night and we could just dance and dance and dance and protest and also in celebration together. That would be just, that would be beautiful. Great, and bachelor number three. Oh, I'm sorry, what? What would you do, bachelor number three, with $500 grant for your campaign date and event? Oh, I'm sorry. Um, I would, I would collect all the non-fair trade products on campus and we'd build a life-size, life-size sculpture of the hundred digits of pi. Pie. That sounds good too. We could do that at the jam band event. Oh, like American Pie? Well, Francesca, you have a um, big decision ahead of you, don't you? Yeah. Who's it going to be? Bachelor number one. Yeah. Bachelor number two. Yo. Or bachelor number three. PHP, baby. Oh, well, it's such a difficult decision. You know what? I can't make this decision. I need more choices. I need you to give me your human rights campaign.
Bachelor number one. Um, party! Yeah!